ukosefu wa ajira umekuwa changamoto kubwa nchini Kenya vijana wengi wakiamini kuwa kupata kazi ni kazi hata hivyo wapo vijana ambao wanabuni njia bunifu za kupata riziki tunakutana na Dennis Karemi ambaye anaunda bidhaa kama vile glesi za maji au divai ama vyombo vya maua maarufu flowers kutoka kwa taka za chupa za glesi kwenye duka lao lifahamikalo kwa jina Karim Glass Solutions eneo la Siokimau kaunti ya Machakos so mimi naitwa Dennis Karemi na kwa socials naitwa Denokuri na nafanya anga kazi ya glass work glass solutions like anything to do with glass so kuna glass work and then kuna bottles kama extension ya glass work Dennis anatuelezea kwamba familia yake imehusika na kazi ya kuunda bidhaa za glesi kwa zaidi ya miongo miwili bali yeye alianzisha kazi ya kuunda bidhaa kutokana na chupa kwa bahati nasibu a 2017 hapo ndio tulianza the first orders za bottle work zili tupata tu tukifanya kazi ya glass someone just came with a few bottles alikuwa anataka kukatiwa and since duka yetu inaitwa glass solution we really had to solve that problem for that person kulingana na karemi bidhaa tofauti tofauti huundwa kutokana na chupa hizi ingawa inalingana na mahitaji ya mteja tuna transform hizi bottles zinakuwa tumblers mm -hmm. uh, drinking glasses mm -hmm. whiskey glasses mm -hmm. uh, water glasses mm -hmm. cocktail glasses mm -hmm. uh, vases mm -hmm. candle holders mm -hmm. ashtrays mm -hmm. uh, bulb holders mm -hmm. bulb lighting bulb fixtures mm -hmm. Karemi huanza kwa kukusanya taka za chupa mbalimbali kama vile za mvinyo zilizotupwa kwenye madampo. Hizi glasses uh, with time kuna tume end up kukuwa nazo with time juu sometimes hadi kuna watu wanakuja na bottles zao wanataka wakatiwe. So wakikam nazo sometimes wanazi drop wana, wana some good ones then wanaacha zao. So eventually watu na end up kukuwa na bottles hata kama twendi out kuzi outsource. But sana sana kwa outsource uenda kwa madam sites kwenda kuzi outsource for hours chupa za mvinyo hutumika bali tunaelezewa chupa yoyote inaweza kutumika baada ya kupata chupa hizo mchakato wa hatua nne wa kuubadili muonekano wa chupa hizi huanzia hapa ambapo zinakatwa kulingana na bidhaa inayotarajiwa kuundwa ubunifu ukiwa kiungo muhimu hatua ya pili hufanyika hapa ambapo upande wa juu hutolewa sehemu ambazo zinaweza kukata kinachofuata ni kuipitisha chupa hiyo kwenye mashine inayoisawazisha Hatua ya mwisho ni kuisafisha ila iwapo ina vibandiko inatumbukizwa majini kabla ya kusafishwa ili kurahisisha kutoa vibandiko. Glesi hii maridadi iko tayari kuuzwa kwa wateja wa Dennis. So my number one clients ni clubs, hotels, eh, personal people wenye wanataka for home use na watu wenye wanafanya deco. Hao wanne ndio my main clients. Hata hivyo kina Dennis wamefanikiwa kuunda mashine ambayo inafupisha mchakato huu ikimruhusu mtumizi kutumia mashine moja badala ya nne. Licha ya kuwa kitega uchumi cha watu wanne wanaofanya kazi hapa, sanaa hii inachangia kupunguza taka ya chupa za glesi na hivyo kunadhifisha mazingira. Environment ni upon us ku clean eh? So lazima u, ujitume like to make sure the environment is a safer place because you see easy bottles zilikuwa zina lay around huko unapata wase wana have wana have fun wame drink kuna client wangu alikuja mmoja akaniambia alienda Masai Mara akapata simba inacheza na chupa like just fun na hiyo ni kitu mbaya sana kulingana na mtaalamu wa mazingira professor Peter Wangai ambaye ni mhadhiri katika kitivo cha mazingira kwenye chuo cha Kenyatta taka za glesi ikiwemo chupa zina madhara kwenye mazingira glass can be a big challenge when it comes to uh, uh, you know uh, landfills and the land degradation so to say because we have said that uh, it can take even a million years to to degrade Though... mbali na kuongeza thamani ya kile kinachoweza kuonekana kama takataka Profesa Wangai anaeleza kuwa kutumia taka za glesi tena huchangia kuhifadhi nishati kwani hutumia nishati kidogo ikilinganishwa na kuunda glesi upya kutokana na rasilimali hitajika. When we also uh, reuse uh, glasses it means that um, uh, we are also minimizing extraction of uh, raw materials that make glass and I mentioned I said that we need uh, silica we need uh, soda ash we need limestone you know and so we minimize on the extraction of these raw materials and uh, number three, uh, when we we reuse glass we also minimize uh, carbon emissions 
Why do we say so? Because in the process of making glass, uh, there is a lot of uh, CO2 emitted into the atmosphere. And uh, today we know the, the big challenge of CO2 emissions. Uh, it is causing global warming and by extension is causing climate change. Professor Huyu anatuonyesha baadhi ya bidhaa zilizoundwa na wanafunzi wa chuo cha Kenyatta ili kusisitiza haja ya ubunifu na sanaa kama njia kupunguza limbikizo la taka kwenye mazingira akisema taka ni rasilimali. Uh, that's why we say that waste is a resource. Uh, waste is not uh, supposed to be seen like something that is uh, terrible. It is something that can be converted into products. It's something that can create employment. It's something that can contribute so much uh, to the to the to the well-being of the society, economically, socially, and even environment, uh, uh, environmentally. Katika biashara ya Dennis Taka si Taka kwa ni vigai vya chupa ambavyo vunjika na mabaki yote ya chupa yanayotokana na sanaa hii huuzwa kwa wanaochakata upya glesi hizo kwa kuziyeyusha na kuunda bidhaa mpya. Once to make a bottle mm -hmm. hii piece ya juu mm -hmm. kuna mtu ana kama anazi collect, mm -hmm. anazi store, anazi resell kwa mtu mwenye anaenda na melt ana form new products. Okay. Kwa upande wake Dennis anawashauri vijana wasikate tamaa na wawe wabunifu kujitafutia ajira ni kupitia kwa mchakato huu mzima ambapo Dennis pamoja na wenzake wameweza kujipatia ajira wakibadili taka ya glesi kuwa glesi na vifaa vingine ambavyo unaweza kutumia hata nyumbani mwako uh, pia kwa kiasi fulani wakichangia kukabiliana na mabadiliko ya tabianchi Motori Eliud KUTV